when I ask people, what do you, how would you have a heart board? And people say, I just squeeze my hand. But there's so much more to it. So it's really important. So I'm going to show you now how you can elevate the movement a little bit, how you can make the walls. Oh, another question you often get is, how do I make them more sick? So what's really important is what we have to think about is, again, that the horse is responsive to the aids. So when we want to start the half horse, we can do that, first of all, to make it easier, through transitions. Like they, um, uh, Rosie and Matty already did with uh, Gina, they wrote transitions to relax him. So we now ask him to go to walk with me. So what we just asked him, by going back into walk, we said to him, wait. So now we ask him to go forward into trot. Then. So we said, go. Now again, ask him to walk and say, wait. Lighten your hand and say, thank you. So he said, right answer there. Thank you very much. You know your flight partner. If you give us the answer, we like the pressure. And then go. So now we start to shorten that sequence a little bit. We say, wait. Wait. And back to walk. And say, thank you. Say, lighten your hand. And the moment the hand is light, then we can push on again. There. And the hand has to be light at that moment, because if you're holding it in front, and you still 